right? By the way, none of the none of them are musically relevant, but people care about Chris Shaw on the Rock because when she got presented to the social media world, women fell in love with her to say, "Hey, I understand acting out because we've acted out or I've acted out because some fuck nigga didn't treat us right." And that happens a lot. It happens to many of the baby mamas and, and, and you know, you know, sister wives of the world. And it's happening with Krishan Rock. She is super lit because women like to support trauma and damage. Now, what happens with that? They don't care about the dude. So nobody cares about Blueface. And I'm going to tell you what's happening to Blueface. Blueface is having a safari effect where Blueface is starting to feel very insecure because when you're in a relationship with a woman, sometimes your status or your money um, or somehow that's that's the sign signifier of your masculinity, right? Um, this relationship is not going to go too far, but we're going to see what's going to happen re um, in a second because I think Blueface, I'm going to predict this, he's going to start getting violent with her again because if you don't know recently, she's been beating his ass and he really can't do nothing back. Um, but he's going to start getting violent with her again. Um, and it's really just only going to be off the fact that she's the person people care about. Now, I don't give a fuck about Krishan Rock, but there's a woman who do. Now, somebody probably be like, how is she lit? How is she more lit than Blueface? Blah, blah. Let me just show you this. Blueface doesn't put out music, right? Or if you put out music, I read the comments, they're all trash. I'll give you a real quick signifier that she's more lit than him. And this is why he's going to go through all these issues, right? Let me go here. Chat, go go to, this is their Instagram. This is Blueface's Instagram, right? He has 1.8 million followers. Remember, he's the artist. He's the guy. Just go look at his, his last post, 260,000 likes. It's not shabby. Um, it was posted February 11th, okay? 260,000 likes, okay? 3,000 comments. I hope y'all can see it. Sorry, yeah. 3,000 comments, whatever. Whatever. I'm just trying to show you that, and again, social media usually is dominated by women shit. Like, you know, I always tell y'all, um, and by the way, Blueface, you know, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm giving mixed commentary here because I, I, I'm not trying to wail on him. You know what I mean? Like, me and his issues, but like, how long are we going to keep it up, right? I'm not trying to just wail on him. Like, Blueface is also realizing something very valuable. The, the most valuable support is women's support. You see, Blueface could have all those followers Think about it. He has all those followers, and yet he gets 260,000 likes. And the last time he dropped a tape when he was supposedly lit, he sold 17,000. If he dropped a tape now, he'd sell under 3,000 copies. Blueface is musically relevant. Men don't support. Now, let me tell you the difference between men and women audience. So his audience that consumes the music is men. What consumes the drama is women. They love her more than they love him, right? There will be more women who tune into the, remember, 17,000 people bought his album first week last time. You know, on average, or I've done the numbers. You know how many people have subscribed to Zeus, which is the show that showcases a reality show, paying $4.99 a month to watch just their show? A quarter million. So when you drop an album, 17,000 people buy it. When you get hit over the head by your uh, hit over the head um, by your girl with a bottle, a quarter million people are paying monthly four dollars ninety nine cents to fucking watch it. What's more profitable? So even if he's not the A side in the relationship anymore, he's still gonna profit more than they made off music. This is just why I show y'all sometimes music don't really make these motherfuckers that much money. Now, I'm going to just show you why she's just super way more lit than him, right? So he has 260,000 likes. Remember, it, this doesn't come, doesn't translate to music sales, right? Let's look at her. I think her her name is Krishan Rock. Uh, I don't know if it's Chris. Let me just Google it. Krishan Rock Instagram. Okay, this is her name, right? Krishan Rock Instagram. And then I'm going to go to her last picture, which happens to be this picture right here. 
Look, she posted it seven days ago after Blueface posted his last. Remember you had 230? Look, 669,000 likes. No disrespect to Blueface's girl. She's not the she's not the looker. Like, no disrespect. I hope he doesn't feel offended. But she's not the looker. She's not like, oh, my God, everybody has to like. This is just women who loves her. You feel me? He's getting 230. She get two. She gets 669 with 7,000 comments. Okay? When she posts a picture of them, they get more. This is why I be in the mirror all over again, people. I'm just trying to tell you how the truth. He traded in his music career for a career in reality TV. But here's the thing. He's not. He's no longer the star of the show. She's the star of the show. They care about when she posts, not when he posts. They care about her problems, not his problems. It's the reason why every day he gets up trying to beef with me because he wants to create. Yeah, Joey, you can cut that out. Um, yeah. So. And by the way, I'm 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 not like dogging on them, right? But I'm 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 trying to show you how relationships like this work. And we've seen it before, where a man who trades in his musical career to focus on his girl builds her up. She doesn't need a hit single. You need a hit single. Her fame is less fleeting than yours because her fame is is tied to who she's dating. You know why? Because women felt bad for Krishan Rock when at first when you Blueface used to beat her ass they used to look at her and say she deserved better and every woman looks at a girl like that and says that's me and they support her but they don't only stop supporting her because you stop beating her ass and she's beating your ass she's they're gonna just keep supporting her your music fans need a hit for them to support you so essentially she has a bigger audience than him Right now, let me tell you what this does to most men and actually any man. It's a, diff it's a change in power dynamic, because let me tell you what's happening with Blueface right now. The reality is this. The industry is attracted to what's hot. People are friends by opportunity, not by actual, you know, what real friendship is. This is why Blueface has been he's been trying to cope with the fact that these celebrities are following his girl and not him. The first sign of that was Drake. Drake doesn't follow him anymore. I don't know if you guys remember. He had a Drake. He was supposedly supposed to get a Drake feature back in the day. Drake realized he was a one hit wonder. Never got never cleared it. Shit never came out. Drake unfollowed the nigga. He's goofy. You know who Drake follows? His girl. When he gets asked about that, on No Jumper, you know what he says? Uh, uh, can't really explain it. Why does the hottest rapper follow your girl but not you? Uh, uh, well, 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 well he must be a fan of mine because uh, I created her. At no, 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 brother, no. He's following her because. She's a topic that people care about. You're the sideshow. Okay. So that happens. You know what happens next? Let's see. Keep scrolling down. He basically almost unleashed a can of whoop ass on her because she was at the Super Bowl and essentially... Let me give me a second. Essentially, she took a picture with Rick Ross. Look how he talks to her. He's upset that she's at the Super Bowl and Rick Ross want to take a picture with her. He says, oh, shit, my bad. I can't. Uh, could never be my bitch, but I get it. Blah, blah, blah. blah. Bro. Rick Ross don't want to take no pictures with you. She's hot. They all want female followers. Females love Krishan for whatever reason. I'm not saying I don't like her. I don't care about her. But women like Krishan Rock for whatever reason. 
Males do not say we want to be blue face. He's having an inner turmoil, inner conflict. He takes it out on her. Now you can never be my chick, blah, 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 blah. What's the latest now? The latest is little baby supposedly contacting this girl. Look how salty this nigga sounds. And tell me this don't sound like a nigga who's insecure. Blueface, you've gone from being the prize nigga to basically being the consolation, my guy. Okay? You're not the prize no longer, brother. The prize don't have to ask his girl, yo, why is another more lit nigga than me talking to you? This is going to ruin their relationship. Blueface is going to he's going to exist for a little while because he's going to be like, yo, I'm getting money out of this and I'm a pimp like every weird nigga tries to do. Act like, yo, you're this big pimp or whatever the case is. But what's going to hurt his ego overall is when they show up to the next red carpet event and nobody gives a fuck about taking a picture with Blueface. They all care about that girl. It might sound like I'm being harsh, but it's real. She's a bigger star than him. Because they're not in music anymore. They're acting like they're making music, but it's garbage. Both of them are garbage at this point. What actually is enticing is their relationship. And women are more popular for showcasing a relationship than a man. Listen to how insecure he sounds. Now she's saying that all the hot rappers that he would. Did you hear? Did you hear um, Blueface on the phone with Youngboy? The nigga was sucking cock through a phone. I've never seen, like, 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 this shit sounded like one of them little, like, sex hotlines, bro. It was like he was begging, young boy say, yo, send me something. It's like the nigga was trying to rap right then. He was dying to get a young boy verse. Of course. I mean, I'm not even mad at it. Young boy's the hottest out. But he knows he won't get it. When's the last time he's really collaborated with somebody who's really super lit? He can't do it. You think if Lil Baby wanted to give him a verse, he would, nigga, he'd be proud he's trying to suck any cock. But he can't get it. Lil Baby won't even hit him up. Lil Baby don't, I probably don't even follow him. Listen to how he sounds when his girl says, oh, Lil Baby's, me and Lil Baby chopping it up. Listen to how salty he is. He sounds like, you You ever tell your girlfriend that a batter bitch was trying to holler at you and all she do is hate? Yo, that bitch is a hoe. Yo, yo I heard she got a train ran on her. Like, yeah, that's blue face now. I told you. Listen to this. Hi, nigga. Um, I, think you, uh, I think you be letting too many rap niggas be in your face. Sound like a girl. Your girl ever tell you this? You too friendly. I'm going to translate the, the, the bitchalisms that's coming out of his mouth. You too friendly. That's what your girl tells you. When, when you go out, bitches is giving you attention. And you actually just like, yo, you might be the nigga. She don't like it. Oh, wow. They'll be my favorite. By the way, here's the thing, too. And this is why I say she, she's going to lose him or he's yeah he's going to lose her. Because everything he's done to try to embarrass her is only lifted her up. Nigga, you know, she look fucking crazy with that fucking gap tooth, nigga. But instead of encouraging some good dental hygiene. You've told her the only thing that would look good on her is if she fucking. Put a picture of you on her tooth and put it in. Now she's back without a gap because a nigga like this is the worst. He's a parasite. He can't exist if she's doing too well. So that's why, she, look, like if he really cared about her, it'd be like, yo, yo, shorty, like, yo, yo, you eating, wiping your mouth with your sweater and shit. Like, that's not attractive. Like, like he's not trying to help her. He wants y'all to see how disgusting she is because he wants y'all to not want his only defense of keeping her is hoping that nobody lit more lit than him wants her. So he's showing you. Yeah, she don't got no teeth. She don't know how to act. She's. Here's the thing. She's still lit more than him. Just listen. Hey, 
Madura. Do you believe him? You want me in your face? No. That picture you got was. But that picture I got was what? Was who? <laughs> who that picture? On my Twitter, in your face. It was a little baby, but it wasn't like. Huh? Mm -hmm. You are like, oh God, it wasn't even like that. Oh, baby. We was talking about yeah. you. Word. Look. In his feelings. It's like. It's like when you're talking to your girl and your girl be like, oh, yeah, you know that nigga who get more money than you, who do everything better than you. Yeah, me and him was talking. You be like, talking about what? You be like, oh, no, we were talking about you. Really, nigga? Look at the face he giving her. Insecurity. Just look at him. You and Lil Baby were talking about me. What? You know why he's jealous? Lil Baby won't talk to him. It's sad. Lil Baby won't talk to him. You think, you think like... Let's go to the next slide. Cool. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. You can see, by the way, this little energy shift, and this is what I'm saying, the more she go out, she gonna leave this nigga. Because when she hang out with Ruby Rose and other bitches, they're all gonna tell her the same thing. Bro, you're lit. Blueface is a leech. He's not popping no more. You could go get a really lit rapper. They're gonna keep gassing her head up, and she's gonna either beat his ass more, or just leave him. <laughs> Call it, say, oh man, it's good, right? What y'all talking about about me? <laughs> this nigga went to go get some ketchup, nigga. <laughs> what you and little baby was talking about me? <laughs> nigga hurt. Hey, hey, hey. So, saying about me? He one of niggas in denial too. So like, he he think he think he think he the quote unquote main character. She's trying to make up a lie. I'm just saying, hell, you look like. <laughs> oh, hell. Yo, she know how to fuck with this nigga. You ask a chick what her conversation with a nigga was, and then she just started laughing. She said, uh, he was saying, ha, 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 ha. what? Oh, hell nah. Your chick just started laughing? Look. I you my manager. Oh, now you're manager. Right. No, no, no. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Here we go. Cool. Not All too right. friendly. All right. He said, not too friendly. All right. Look, she watching him. This is this is when I keep telling you this is the power dynamic swift is shifting. She's never seen Blueface insecure. That's why she's having fun with it. She's never seen him insecure because before this, she felt she was lucky to be with him. She thought he was the prize. She's realizing quickly, oh, this thing is just trying to keep me at any cost. Look, look, and here's the thing, man. This fucking gap tooth right here looks ridiculous, but it is what it is. <laughs> Call it, say, oh, man, you're good, right? What y'all was talking about about me? Damn, this nigga hurt. <laughs> Look at this nigga's face. What was y'all talking about me? Yo, you know what's so funny about blue face? Your blue face, no disrespect to you, brother. Little baby don't want your bitch, my nigga. Like, she, she got a fucking gap tooth and look like a saber tooth tiger, my nigga. No disrespect to her. He don't, you're the only nigga who want her. Like, there's, like, this is how you know he's defensive. Nigga, there's nobody competing for your girl but you, bro. There's nobody, nigga. There's nobody. Like, he's so insecure, he thinks little baby is trying to fuck his girl. 
Nigga, you the only nigga competing, bro. You should have known that. That's why you told her to keep the teeth out. But you're scared to lose your fucking spot. Nigga, my bitch look better than that. I ain't gonna lie to you. That's fact. Everybody bitch look better than her. Stop playing. <laughs> This woman Blueface was like, yo, act, you could get your pussy right. I'm like, nigga, I got a bad bitch to you. Fuck is you talking about, kid? Boy, you, you can't be talking like that, nigga. Richer than you ain't got a bad bitch to you. And I'm fat. Nigga, you just tall for no reason, gang banging and doing that crip walk, nigga. The fuck is you doing? This saber tooth tiger you got going on, nigga. Nobody wants her, nigga. Look, baby, you think, look, nigga. Jada would laugh Lil Baby off of this planet if this nigga went from her to that. You the only nigga, bro. I don't know how this nigga really think like, yo, he's like, what you and Lil Baby talking about? Yo, Sam, about me. I'm just saying, hell, you just like. <laughs> I just like, bro. Oh, hell nah. She done start laughing? Oh, hell nah, bro. You my manager. Oh, now you're manager. I don't know. Damn. Yo, violating that nigga. She said, yeah, I was just telling him how you my manager. Yo, Chris, I think Chris is stupid as a motherfucker. But, but I'm going to tell you, she not that stupid. You know why? Remember Blueface was saying, you fuck 10 niggas, baby ain't mine. He said, yo, we broke up this, that, and the third. You know the quickest way to get an insecure nigga to claim you? Oh, what you and the really lit rap nigga was talking about me? Oh, I was just telling him you're my manager. Now watch him. He gonna be on some shit like, you ain't telling him I'm your boyfriend? Yo, you ain't, yo, yo. What, what the fuck? <laughs> what is it? He on some, you ain't telling him I'm your boyfriend? Now he want to be claimed as boyfriend. Look. Look. All right. All right. Chat, I'm going to break this relationship down, nigga. You can call it, say, oh, man, you're Yo, here's the funny thing in the comment section. Nobody wants her but him. <laughs> oh, man. Talking about, about me. Hey, hey, hey. Yo, about me. I was just saying, you know, you just like. <laughs> oh, watch her laugh. <laughs> I just like, look. You my manager. <laughs> oh, now you're manager. I don't know. Hey, right. but you are my nigga. Right. We just crazy. What? You know, everybody. This making fun. You my nigga. Hey, I see. They be talking about how crazy you are. Right, right, right. Took the hand around her. Babe, it was nothing like her. That's all you said. <laughs> That's all he said. Can you say nothing like that? <laughs> cool. Nice. <All right. laughs> <laughs> oh. What? What you want me to what, say? What, what he said? What he said? <laughs> what he said? Yo, blue face, man. You sounded pathetic, nigga. Even though me and baby beefing, nigga, I might have to just tell him to DM you, nigga. You sound like you. You sound like you was trying to mack it to blue to, to, to little baby, nigga. He, nigga, he was talking to saber tooth tiger, not you, cat. He was talking to Saber Tooth. Let him rock. Let, let, let him kick his game. Yo, Blueface, you gotta realize you like a little nigga in the industry. Like, like, like when a nigga see that you with a girl, niggas be like, oh, she's single. Like, oh, she's still single. Like, niggas still hollering at her. You feel me? And I ain't gonna lie to you. Me and Blueface ain't on. Nah, nah, me and me and little baby ain't on the best terms. But I guarantee you, he was not trying to holler at the Saber Tooth Tiger, bro. No fucking way, bro. No way, bro. I kid you not, dog.
Bro, it's no reason why Blueface, the, the, the known bitches that Blueface been with, I'm getting better bitches than him. I ain't going to lie to you. This is a shame. <laughs> you see why I work out? I'm like, if this nigga's doing all this shit, crip walking every 13 seconds, he's 6'8", and this is the bitches he bagging the fuck? I'm sorry, man. Or maybe he just don't got the bread like, like well, he definitely don't got the bread like me, but. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, this nigga looking through the gap right now. He's trying to see into her soul. <laughs> oh, man. He looking through the gap. Oh, man. Say it ain't so. I'm going to lie to you. Even the, even the chick that tried to falsely ac uh, accuse me of being with I think even Selena look better than that bitch. And I never, and for the record, I never was dating a Selena. And y'all could definitely look better than that bitch. Yo, this chick is trash. Well, I got potential. Potential to what? Fuck up? Nah, I'm a dope for real. Why are you saying me like that? It was, a, it was an innocent what, conversation. What else you said? Somebody said, I'm 35 breaking down. I'm not 35, but don't matter. Listen, let me tell you this. Uh, I break down everything, motherfucker. <laughs> just like I just broke down with why so Woody snitching, nigga. That's what I do, nigga. I break every, everything down. Okay. Don't lie. God's watching. All right. It was a... All right. Uh... It's to kind of wrap this up, man. Yo, blue face, man. Blue face. Blue face. Blue face. Blue face. I'm going to give you this little tidbit right here. Actually, I want to call other people's names into this shit. This relationship, and I got nothing against you, you're in a relationship. You know what I mean? You, you, you send jabs at me too, so you know what I mean? You got to take them too, right? And, um, you know, I'm happy you're happy. You seem like you're happy. You need to get lit on your lonely rather than being her shadow or else you'll never be happy as a man. That's just really what it is. And, and if you think otherwise, nigga, watch. She going to torment you. Everybody else going to clown you. And your fucking peers have on all, all unfollowed you and they're following your girl. You know what they're going to do? Eventually, they're going to be like, yo, by the way, they might have told your girl, like, yo, yo, you could come to our Super Bowl suite that costs $1.2 million, but you can't bring him in. Blueface, that's how they're going to be talking about you. Yeah, you could come kick it with us, blah, 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 but you got to come dolo. So she going to have to show up without you, brother. And when she show up to little Baby Suite, Future Suite, Drake Suite, yeah, nigga, what happens, happens, chalk it up to the game. Remember, you said them niggas is fans of you. Well, you're going to be having these awkward conversation, eating like a, eating a, a $5 wing combo, trying to figure out if she fucked them niggas or not. It is what it is, Crody. All right, man. Let me let Blueface live for another day, man. Recently, he began into a Chris Brown. I won't even get into that. Or maybe I'll get into that, but I'll get into that tomorrow. Uh, we we got to touch on the Charleston White situation a little bit. My boy Charleston White was, you know, he was kind of perturbed. They'll be in my face. Nah. Hold on. What? What you want me to what, say? What? What you say? <laughs> Come on. Anything in your face is in my face. I'm right on your neck. Potential to what? <laughs> nah. I'm a dope for real. Why are you saying me like that? It was, a, it was an innocent what, conversation. What else he said? Don't lie. God's watching. You know, I got to say it. Yeah, what do you say? I can say it in here. No, I was saying to us, we here. It's a must man, what do you say? Mm -hmm. You want me around and shit? He want you around? Yeah, but like, probably to work, you know? Oh, so little baby told her he wanted her around. 
I'm believing this is cap. I ain't gonna lie to you. Look, baby, don't wanna fuck her. Like, nigga, stop it, nigga. But I think she's making up a good story to fool this nigga. You know what's so crazy? Because he's just writing this whole he's writing this whole story out the industry. Like, nigga, you not you not big act, nigga. You can't you can't go at little baby, nigga. You gotta bow down a little baby, fool. You ain't had a hit since three years ago. Level up. It was an empowerment conversation, it wasn't like <laughs> Y'all had an empowerment conversation at 5 a.m. What that was the after party. Oh y'all had an empowerment conversation at the after party. Well him all up in your face like this. Yeah, yeah. That's working. What? Damn near up in my face, girl. Like what? Okay. <laughs> you wanna <laughs> me too? Like damn. Hey, 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 chill out. First of all. And in your face is in my face. I'm right on your neck. Like. Damn, this nigga really pressed. Like, you, you gonna be looking at me like, like, a or something? Did he say the little baby wanna fuck him? No, hold on. Let me let me find the uncensored version of this shit. This type of ghetto shit, man. Let me see if I can find the whole thing. Conversation at 5 a.m. Yeah. What? That was the after party. Oh, y'all had an empowerment conversation at the after party. Yeah. Well, him all up in your face like this. Yeah, yeah. That's working. Yeah, blue face. That's kind of how it goes when a nigga's trying to fuck your bitch. But I don't think that. I don't think. I don't think little baby was trying to. I'm gonna keep it on it, bro. What? Damn near up in my face, girl. Like what? Okay. <laughs> you wanna fuck me too? Like, damn, I wanna fuck you. Hey, 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 chill out. First of all, any nigga in your face is in my face. I'm right on your neck. Like, yo, blue face is like some like low level, slow ass pimp shit that he's trying to do. Any nigga in your face is in my face. No. No. This is what I told y'all about them tattoos. And tattoos is manipulation, bro. Nigga fucking you. He, he gonna be looking at me while he fucking you? Like, cut with a fucking me or something? Make <laughs> <laughs> no sense. If I seen any of these niggas bitches out with seven tattoos, missing a tooth, pregnant. All right, don't do that. Pregnant. You know what's so funny? And this is why I know this chick is slow. Like, saber tooth tiger over here, snaggle tooth, slow as shit. The nigga, the nigga even disses her while trying to basically question why another rapper would want her. He's basically saying, bro, I went and got the bottom of the fucking barrel. Bro, she got seven tattoos, missing a tooth, knocked up, basically saying, why the fuck would you want her? If I seen any of these niggas bitches out with seven tattoos, missing a tooth, pregnant, right, don't do that. pregnant and all, I'm not gonna approach them like, yo, I think you're dope. But uh, I want you around, like, you got potential. It was cool, it wasn't like <laughs> thirsty. <laughs> sounds crazy. First of all, you just like. So that picture didn't look thirsty. You know what? It I looks like I couldn't hear. Wait, you wanna know what I wanna know? I wanna know who. Yo, the bitch got like fucking food stains in her mouth, bro. Like, this is this this is what he think little baby's trying to like bag, bro. This thing is delusional, dog. Who the fuck is taking these pictures? <laughs> like, somebody is setting me up for real. Cause it just be the best picture because they bleed you every time. I'm like, who is this nigga? All up in the bitch face. She's not pregnant. It's 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 a lie that they're doing to to encourage you to watch either next season or some other shit. Like the producers talk to me, bro. Like she's not pregnant. It's a lie. She's not pregnant. Just to let you know, she's not pregnant. She's drinking in the club. She's doing everything. She's not pregnant. Okay. All right. Like how? Who's taking the picture? <laughs> There's people around. Are you, you trying to? You, 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 
keep like a little it was a party around and make me mad or something. I mean, you be doing what you be doing, you know? I don't yeah, really. But I ain't on camera. What? You on camera? You're not on camera, blue face, because you fell off. It wasn't like that. Like I don't even know what y'all think, Ty. No, you <clears throat> act like y'all don't got each other numbers. That's what I'm saying. So if you saw potential in you and you in the right, you would have called Blue. All right. Yeah. What happened? been professional. You wouldn't be in your face at 5 a.m. at an after party talking about, I want you around. Damn near. He damn near kissing me. Yeah, cut all up on you like this. Why? Be nice. Damn, little baby. You know, Blueface, you're making a lot of sense now. Yo, give me this clip. I need it for the gram. Yo, somebody give me this clip right here. I need it for the gram. Give me this clip. I need it for the gram. I got a caption for this bitch already. You wouldn't be in your face at 5 a.m. at an after party talking about, I want you around. Damn near. He damn near kissing me. Yo, memes, I, 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 I need this clip. Top, matter of fact, get it, get it to me tonight. And I can leave it on my page to make it soak. I need this bitch to soak. Yeah, cut all up on you like this. Why? Be nice. I want you around. Yeah, yeah. What you want me to get the picture for you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me the picture for time. Yeah. You crazy. I ain't tripping, y'all. She just be friendly two times sometimes. How am I friendly when we yeah. not really in a relationship? Yeah, you be friendly. And what you call you? Private. I called me. That was a private party. It was a private party. I'm just joking. All right, next. Can we not talk about him? All right, let's talk about. Yo, this chick got a stain on. Like she got like food stains on her mouth, but this is crazy though. You. Let's talk about Rick. Oh, this is Rick Ross now. They talking. About. That was just a high and by situation. I see where you coming from because I just did my research. Uh huh. And what you find out when you did your research? I guess he was fucking on one of your exes. Uh -huh. But that had nothing to do with me. I didn't know nothing about. Yo, Blueface. Let me give you a reality, man. Like, listen, listen, listen. I don't know if you think you look good this and third. You and you're fucking with industry bitches, bro. Industry bitches don't even give a fuck about looks. Nigga, you're fucking irrelevant. Nigga, the ugliest nigga on earth, if he's more lit than you, get a bad bitch than you, nigga. Or we'll take your bitch. I'm telling you this as a fact. And all the brainwashing you're doing to this girl don't fucking matter. Because when she see a little baby, she gonna go. When she see Ricky Rose with that fucking nigga, y'all eating at some bum-ass wing place, Rick Ross is going to bring her to the Wingstop headquarters. You're in the corner of the fucking place connecting to Wi-Fi trying to go live when Ricky Rose brings her to the Wingstop headquarters, nigga. Then to the promised land. If he wants her, he'll get her. You can't keep niggas from getting your girl. You got an industry girl, nigga. Well, she was an industry at first. She was a some ratchet hood rat, but you made her industry. You made her care about all the metrics that everybody loses or takes niggas girls with. You made her a celebrity. So now she cares about celebrity shit. You ever seen young boy making his, his chicks like running around these joints taking pictures with niggas? Fuck no. Not if you not if he still want him. Go look at the chicks young boy be fucking with. They don't follow one fucking rapper, nigga. Go. Go go look at that.
Okay. He probably don't even know the correlation of that. Seems weird to me. He took a picture with everybody at the Super Bowl, babe. He wouldn't probably even took a picture with you. You just wasn't there. No, see, that's the crazy part. If I was around you, <laughs> I guarantee you none of these niggas would be walking up, trying to talk, take no picture, talking. Of course they wouldn't be walking up to you, nigga. You're fucking irrelevant. You're cold. Yo, let me tell you how cold rappers get, get treated in this game. You don't want too many pictures with a nigga who cold. They might think you cold too. You're cold. You're not hot. You take a picture with a whack nigga, they might think you whack too. I fuck with you. I want you around. I guarantee you they'll be acting like looking the other way. That's how I know it's boo. Yeah. Hey, let me tell you this, man. You see, you see all these niggas, they're still in the denial, nah, man. This is industry, y'all fucking industry bitches. Let me tell you how it fucking works. Big bank take low bank. You know who you know who be fucking the baddest fucking bitches? Some of them you don't even well, first of all, Floyd fuck all of them, right? Niggas is wife and Floyd leftovers. Why? Because Floyd get all the bitches. Why? Is it because the Floyd's 5'4. He's a 5'4 nigga who can box. The bitches ain't with him because of his looks. They with him because that's money made. Nigga, Rick Ross, 350 pounds. Nigga, you only lose weight to make sure he keep living. You don't got to lose weight for bitches. He going to still fuck him. He got the promised fucking land. Birdman get whoever the fuck he wants. He's worth a billy. You know who be getting mad chicks? I ain't trying to blow his situation up. My man, hey, listen, well, well, y'all seen a couple. P, they have bitches fighting over that nigga. Why? He owned QC. Or he did. Nigga, look at the people I'm naming and then put all their pictures up next to each other. You think these are the, oh, these are the lookers that women are looking for? No, it's industry bitches. Industry bitches. Fuck the lit niggas. That's it. If you get your girl to be an industry bitch, she's going to fuck a lit nigga. That's it. Get mad all you want. That's it. And they all fuck Drake. If they, all, they all will fuck Drake. Yes, Drake follow Krishan. Drake don't follow Blueface. Drake know you still mad. And this is me saying it's not Drake. Drake know you're so mad because he ain't giving a verse, nigga. <laughs> Just don't get mad when she gets invited to come to the embassy. Like, maybe he want to work on some music with her. Maybe him, Chubbs, Baka. Gotta have Smiley there. Come on. Work on some music. You be at home, nigga, figuring it out. All right, cool. Yo, could y'all give me the, the clip? I, I want not nah, actually forget that trick trick shit, bro. All right, let me, let me just go back in on this topic. Yo, so this is Charleston White. Uh, 